The sooty olive is a traditional Irish loch pattern. It is often fished in the early part of the season for the duck fly, as the Irish call it. For the rest of the world, this would be chironomids and buzzers. Later on during the summer months, tied in slightly larger sizes, it is often used for sea trout. The hook and device is a Camazan B175 in a size 14. The thread is Benecci, 12 volt in black, simply attached back of the eye, run down a few turns, and then excess is trimmed. The ribbing material is a fine silver wire which is tied in underneath the hook and it's kept kept there while the thread is advanced to halfway between the point and the barb. The tail material on the original is golden pheasant tippet. I prefer to use Lady Amherst tippet dyed hot orange. I simply like the slightly brighter color. Just trim away a few barbs. I like to tie in the tail with the second bar just black bar just showing. Like this. Then secured. The body material is a seals for a mix or you substitute if seal is not available. I've made a mix of black, dark olive, dark brown and a pinch of fiery brown. A small amount is dubbed onto the thread. With the anchor point in place, the seal spur can be tightened up a bit. Then taper down towards the front as not to create a shoulder to push up the wing. Next, the ribbing goes on in even spaced turns. then it's worried off. For the collar I use a natural black hackle. Some people prefer to do a throat. I prefer to have a, a full collar. So just stripped away some of the fluff. Tie in the hackle. From away the, the butt section. Next clip on some hackle pliers. And wrap a two or three turn collar. Stroke back to hackle some. Locked angle into place. For the wing, it's bronze mallard. I'll simply use about this amount that you see here. Make sure that the tips are evened. The section is doubled and then doubled again to make for a, not too heavy a wing but still a present wing. With a pinch and loop the wing is tied in. Second turn. Now we can see if the wing is angled okay. 
looks all right. Trim away. The waste. Then proceed to form a neat small head. And finish it off with a three turn whip finish. Trim away the thread. Bring the hackle in line somewhat. And that completes the sooty olive.